Hello everyone, my name is Aiki Sebita and this is your first time seeing my face and you enjoy music video reactions, beyond tutorials, demonstrations on other instruments, definitely consider subscribing. I am a black musician songwriter from America. I live in South Carolina currently. I am currently 28 years old, in case I've never said this before, just to give you a little brief introduction. You know, I find it funny how, you know, two years ago when I was, you know, doing my reaction videos and stuff like that, I was notoriously eating on camera. People call it mukbang, right? And I was getting dragged through the ends of the earth. Y'all niggas was dragging me, you know what I'm saying? But now it's like everybody's doing mukbang and like that's the cool thing. And now it's like socially acceptable. Man, fuck y'all. Anyways, this is going to be a reaction to Park Bone. This actually um, stems off from my last reaction I did, Spring, which is her um, comeback song. You know, I asked a few questions like, you know, why is, you know, she never really has any close-up of her face. And, you know, you guys told me that she, I guess, got backlash from plastic surgery and stuff like that and this comeback is a big deal because it's the first one I think it's the first one I don't know since her um I guess she had a drug scandal where she was taking drugs prescribed to her in the United States but illegal in Korea um based on her military illness which I don't discredit whatsoever so this is actually going to be a live performance this is actually going to be acoustic which I love acoustic performances because you really get to see what the artist is made of so I'm really excited so this is going to be Don't Cry let's get started She has like a sultry Asian voice. You only find like, well, the K-pop, that sultry, husky, mid-range. Voice back to punch though. Come on, vibrato. My oh my gosh, my laptop's going crazy, man. Let me be great. Come on. All singers out there, try to refrain from breathing in the middle of a phrase. So this is supposed to be the meat and potatoes of her voice. She has that little twang. I mean, I'm not talking about vibrato, but it's like a certain way, like you say certain vowels. I feel like emotional. She's definitely very emotional when she sings. I think that's what separates a lot of main vocals from what I She's a main vocal, from B vocalist. Main vocals are able to be a little bit more immortal. I mean, think about it. All your favorite groups compare the main vocals versus the lead vocals, and the main thing is immortal, the emotion.
So that's my takeaway, is that she's a very emotive singer. Whenever I think of um, Park Boom, like, that's the first thing that comes to mind, like, I think that's with a lot of, well, not all main singers and groups, but definitely, like, Taeyeon Girls' Generation, um, Sun Ye from the Wonder Girls, and I think of um, Hyodin from um, Sistar, any other groups, what other groups do I follow? And she's definitely a swell singer. I'm always late to the party when it comes to groups. When I like, just start to get in the groups, they're always either disbanded or getting ready to disband. Except the Wonder Girls. I pretty much followed Wonder Girls since 2008. I followed Girls' Generation. I got into them relatively late. I think I got into them maybe like 2015. At this point, Jessica had already been released from the band. Um, let me see. Rania. Uh, pretty much after they got through all of like the no I, I started following them in demonstrate so D, C, and T were still part of the band but other than that I, I seem to always be late to the party so I'm gonna have to go back and do a little bit more research about um, 2 and one kind of find out their backstory listen to their hits what are some hits what are their biggest hits 2 and one's hits that you think I should you know take a look to take a, li a listen and a look to but thank you so much for watching this with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I definitely enjoyed this. Um, English subs are definitely going to start being my friends. So you guys don't know this, but you guys always say, you know, English subs. But I always download the video to my hard drive and then I watch it. I never watch it really from YouTube. I probably need to start watching it from YouTube. That way I can turn on like captions and stuff like that and translations. Thank you so much for watching this with me. And if you want to see more, if you want to see less, definitely subscribe, like, and leave a comment. You all have a lovely, lovely night.